All right, welcome to my double agent pack review. This looks to be one of the best packs we've ever had in Fortnite. Now with that said, there does appear to be a little bit of a glitch going on with these packs. So as you can see, there are two packs in the item shop currently. One is the double agent pack itself with the three skins. And the price for that is 2,500 V-Bucks. And then there's the Shadow Pickaxe Pack, which is 1,200 V-Bucks. So the glitch is this. When you buy the first one, it won't let you buy the other one. So look at this. I actually got gifted this pack, so I own it. 2,500 V-Bucks, I already own. Then when I go to the Shadow Pickaxe Pack, I have 1,975 V-Bucks, and it only costs 1,200. But look at this. It says get V-Bucks. I don't need V-Bucks. I have enough already. And likewise, if you try to gift it, I'm going to treat yourself and watch what happens. This friend already owns this item or is otherwise ineligible. Please select another friend to gift it to. And then if you try to gift it to someone else, it still doesn't work. So I think the system thinks that when you buy one, you own both. Because I have a friend that bought the Shadow Pickaxe pack first, and now he can't buy the Double Agent pack. So as of this video, it's probably going to be fixed when some of you watch this video, but right now... I cannot buy this pack, and it's really irritating. All right, so first up, let's do the Chaos Double Agent. So here he is in his ghost form with his ghost back bling. You can see that he's got a solid gold mask, and then everything else is pretty much white. His shoes are gold, and obviously his skin, if you want to call it that, is gold as he's well. He's also got a gold tie and a little handkerchief in there. Now his back bling... You know, I don't know what that's supposed to be. Some kind of, almost like an oxygen container feeding that golden ooze into his helmet there. So that is the ghost one. And here he is in his goopy. That's a pretty funny style name for that, the goopy form. You can see it spreads up near his shoulders. That's kind of creepy, actually. Wait, did he have gloves in the first one? He did. Okay. I just didn't notice that. And he's got the Terminator 2 bad guy ooze sprinkling out of his head there. That is actually pretty cool. I really enjoy that. So now let's swap to the Shadow Chaos Double Agent. Here he is with his Shadow back bling. In my opinion, Shadow wins this one. Shadow is way, way better than Ghost with this particular skin. As you can see, everything remains the same. Everything that was gold with the Ghost version is still gold with the Shadow. And everything that was white now turns to a jet deep black. Wow. I don't know. In my opinion way way better than this one wow pretty phenomenal and the back bling is the same let's check out the goopy form so in this form i'm not too sure that shadow wins i kind of like the ghost one in this one i think the solid gold face there goes really well with the white i mean it's not bad in this one either but i actually like the ghost one better this is just an all-around great skin i am just impressed I didn't like the Chaos Agent originally, but wow, with these two styles, this blows the original skin out of the water. All right, let's check out the Double Agent Wild Card next. So here's the Ghost version first. You can see he is a tall string bean. He's got those nice golden shoes. He's got a little bit of black on the back of his mask, which is what we would be seeing when we play, because of course you only see from this perspective. But when you spin him around, he's got that gold on the front. His under-the-suit shirt is gold as well. Really, really nice. And then the back bling, the handcuffs are gold, and the suitcase is white. Hmm, I don't know. I think, again, Shadow wins for this particular skin. I much prefer the gold and black as opposed to the gold and white with this one. I don't know. He just looks much cleaner with this one. Let me know in the comments if you agree, but so far, I think Shadow is winning the day. The back bling, I don't know, you could argue both, but this one's not too bad. I'm not fond of this back bling to begin with, but actually, you could probably run the white one with this, the ghost version, I mean, or even vice versa. Let's see what that looks like. Hold on. Let's just swap that back. I mean, I don't know. There's gold in both of them. Let's try the ghost with the shadow one. Yeah, I don't know. I think you could pull it off, but you may as well stick to what's supposed to go with them. So again, I mentioned I feel like this is the weakest skin of the pack, but still, it's not very weak. It's just my least personal favorite. Now, let's go to my favorite skin, the Double Agent Hush. So we'll start with the Ghost version. Let me get her back bling going. 
I don't know why, but I just truly enjoy this skin. She's just menacing. Look at her evil face. I don't even think I own the original Hush. Let me look. I think my son Jack does, but I don't think I do. Oh, never mind. Someone must have gifted it to me. I mean, look at this. Even her pose is different. This is not a bad skin either. I love her anime eyes, but this one. Look at those golden eyes and the flake of gold in her hair. Look, she has no difference in her hair in the original form. Boy, I just love this. The ghost one is phenomenal, but the shadow one is absolutely magnificent. Look at this. Brilliant. The gold and black and that gold and black hair. Holy smokes. This is incredible. Here she is with her actual back bling. Man, I just love the physics of the hair as well. It just sways as you sway. Beautiful. The gloves are golden black. The grenades around her chest, golden black. Everything golden black. Not a bad back bling either. The Black Knight shield with this one. I don't know why, but I just absolutely love this. Brilliant. I love it. Probably my favorite skin in this entire pack. Wow. All right, so here we go. The Shadow Hush first. And again, unfortunately, I couldn't run her pickaxes because it is glitched out of its mind. Let's just take a peek here and see what she looks like. Not bad. Absolutely perfect in my opinion. Like I said several times so far, this is my favorite skin. I just love that mask. It reminds me of Scorpion from Mortal Kombat. Man, look at her eyes. Her eyes almost glow gold. In fact, I think they are glowing gold. How about old school? Let's check this out. Oh, she had her eyes closed there. I'm pretty sure they glow. Yeah, that is awesome. I guess we'll see for sure in just a second because the sun is setting. Here's what she looks like in the light. Now, there's no wrap that goes with her, but I use Midas's, which is pretty sweet. Check this out. That's not bad. You can see a little bit of gold on there. So here we are at night. I think she looks even better at night. Let's spin her around and see if her eyes truly glow. Oh, they kind of do. I think they really do. Yeah, they do. It's kind of hard to see, but they're definitely fluorescent. And she closes her eyes a lot with this one. Uh, let's try to strut. Turn yourself around, Miss Hush. But yeah, I think they do for sure. Yeah, they definitely do. Pretty sure do. they do. And they were glowing in the daylight as well. So, phenomenal skin here. Absolutely perfect. Like I said, my favorite of the three. Shadow Hush, number one. All right, so here is the ghost version of Hush. In the locker screen, at least, I didn't... Oh, shoot, there's a guy right here. Get out of my face. In the locker screen, I didn't really enjoy this one, but it doesn't look too bad right here. In fact, the white is pretty nice. Let's uh, flip him around. Actually, I want I don't want to dance on this guy. I'll wait till he unspectates me. All right, well, he's not going away, and I don't have all day, so I'm going to dance just to turn around and check the eyes out. So let's do this one. Sorry, buddy. Yeah, so the eyes definitely are glowing on this ghost version as well. Man, that looks nice. And it doesn't look too bad with this pickaxe either. You know, I thought I wouldn't enjoy this one, but I'm actually really enjoying it. In fact, ah, man, I don't know. I don't think I like it more than the shadow one, but it's super nice. Look at this. There's just not as much gold on this one, it seems like. Like, it's very hard to see the gold from the back. But still, a great, great skin. There's a lot of people here. Pow! Right in the kisser. You little fish man. <laughs> He's got me scared. Wow, Jackie. I want to see. Wowie, that guy got riggedy wrecked by Ghost Hush. Let's go. All right, next up here is the Shadow Wild Card. So I'm not going to lie. We've seen so many Wild Card remakes 
that he just seems a bit boring, and that's why I've labeled him as my least favorite of the three. The back bling is a little darker in color, and I'm not sure why. Let me get into my super secret gas station over here so I can take a look. Let's look in the daylight first. So see how dark the back bling is compared to his suit? His suit is almost like a gray. Not necessarily a jet black like every other skin has been. Oh god, there's a guy right there. Please be a weapon in here. Oh man. Let's see if we can blow him up. Wait, is this a bot? It might be a bot. Are you are you, are you real? What are you? I think this is a bot. I got a gun, bro. You better run. I'm wild card. Pickaxe me. Are you real? Yeah. It's for the loot, kid. I don't know. I think that was a bot. So as I was saying, yes. Look at the back bling compared to the suit. I mean, he's just very, uh, very bland. He's basically just a gray suit. Because you can barely see any of the gold just on his little Friday the 13th Jason mask there. Let's spin him around. Yeah, his front is where all the gold is. I mean, I do like his shoes. But you can't see his undershirt, which is bright gold, and you can't see the front of his mask. Hmm, not much else to say about this one. Get out of my face. Get out of here. All right, next up here is Ghost Wildcard. Now, I actually enjoy this one a lot more than the Shadow one. In game, that is. However, if you own the original wild card, it's basically the same. This one's like a little bit upgraded from the original one because you can see the gold on the back of the Jason Voorhees mask, like I mentioned before. But it's much cleaner on this one as opposed to the shadow one. So in game, yes, I totally like this one more because the suit on that shadow one was just totally off-putting. I wish it was jet black instead of gray. This one's much, much cleaner. And the back bling as well, it stands out excellent along the white suit. Let's see if we can spin them around, take a look at the front. Yeah, just overall much cleaner. Very, very nice. But like I said, if you own the original wild card, it's very, very similar to that. Just with a little bit of gold on it. So overall, as I've mentioned several times now, this is definitely the weakest link in the pack. But with that said, the ghost one here definitely wins the day. I love how the yellow almost looks like an orangish color in the dark. Very, very nice. So I try to bamboozle this guy with multiple awesome wild cards. But I don't have the same deep jacket. Wow. He got you to 40 HP. That dude wrecked me with that yeah. charge. He literally fell for the wild cards, though. The fake wild cards. Waka waka, Jackie. Waka waka. Yes, um, awesome, just, Jackie. So you're, awesome. You just don't. All right, so here is the ghost chaos agent. I think this is the one everyone really wanted from this pack. But this one, I don't know. This style's not really doing it for me. I don't know. This, of course, is with the helmet on. I do like the back bling though, because when you jump, you can see the nasty goop coming out of there. That's pretty cool. Let's spin him around. So his eyes do glow a bit white. That's pretty cool. And the oxygen mask or whatever that is, the dark mask that he's got on kind of connects to the back bling, so that's also neat. But other than that, I don't know. Definitely a lot of white and not a lot of gold. You can just see on his mask and his feet. That's it. Other than that, pure white. Not bad, but not the best.
All right, so here is the ghost style with the goopy style as well. This one is pretty creepy. I don't have the original Chaos Agent, but I don't know. That thing, it looks like a thumb. His head looks like a thumb. But at least it's animated. You can see the effect as it drips up. Solid gold as well. There's more gold on this one, so I do enjoy this one a bit more, even though it is disgustingly weird. Let's spin him around. The front looks almost like a white. Like the front of his face. I don't know, that's creepy. I'm telling you. This whole skin is creepy. This is what he looks like in game. Not too bad. Yikes. Yeah, even when you jump, you can see that goop. Oh, it's so gross. I like it. All right, now we're swapping to the Shadow Chaos Agent, and I think this is his true form because he's meant to be a black, dark skin. And this just looks so, so good. The dark black mixed with that gold, absolutely perfect. I feel this color black is what the wild card should have been. Look at this. This is truly great. So the Shadow Chaos Agent wins for me because, I don't know, this just looks perfect. Let me spin him around. Let's take a peek. You can see that fluorescent white glow from his eye mask. That's pretty nice. Yeah, he just looks so much better in a black suit than opposed to the white one. This is a great skin. I can't wait to see the next style. It'd be more convenient if I had his real pickaxe, but not bad. And here we are, last but not least, the goopy style for Mr. Shadow Chaos Agent. Again, definitely looks much better in the black suit. Let's go into the shade here and check this out. I still think this is one of the creepiest skins in the game, just because of the lack of face, so to speak. Let's spin him around. I don't know why it's white. This is exactly what the ghost version did as well. But that white, almost like transparent mummified effect on his face, that creeps me out even more. It's just on his like chin and neck area. I don't know. You know what? After seeing this, I think I much prefer the one with the helmet. At least in the shadow suit. In the ghost one, I kind of like this effect. But to each their own, I guess. So there you go. That is all there is to it for this double agent pack. In my opinion, this is one of the best packs in the game, if not the best. Not only do you get three different skins, but you get three separate styles, essentially giving you six skins in total. Now, if you couple in the multiple styles for Chaos Agent, it's even better. So you really can't go wrong with this pack because even if you don't like one of the skins, you may like them in the alternative style. Now, if I had to give my own thoughts and comments on these, I would say for the Chaos Agent, definitely Shadow wins. I would much prefer to run the black suited Chaos Agent now for Hush, I have to say it again, the shadow definitely looks much cooler, especially because of the highlight in the hair. Now I know she does have it on this one, but it's not as noticeable. Definitely going with Shadow Hush. Now for the double Asian wild card, I did like this one, but since we can only see from the back, and he's pretty bland from the back anyway, I'd go with the ghost style. Now he does look eerily similar to the original wild card form, but there's just a bit of gold to make him unique. So that's my personal preference, Shadow, Shadow, and then Ghost. And if I had to rate the three skins, I would say Double Agent Hush is my favorite, followed by the Chaos Agent, and then the Wild Card. So let me know in the comments which style you prefer for each character, Shadow or Ghost. So is this pack worth 2,500 V-Bucks? Absolutely. Is this the best pack in the game? In my opinion, yes. Anyone should be thrilled to have this in their collection. Three awesome skins, two awesome styles for each one, even more with the Chaos Agent, and some awesome back blings to boot. This is totally worth the price. You should totally get this. Absolutely epic. So that's all there is to it for the Double Agent Pack. Stay tuned for the Shadow Pickaxe Pack, which I'll review next. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. A like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is TABATIME.